Hello, Chris. Uh, I appreciate the opportunity to be able to uh, display what uh, Sell My Teas is all about to you. Uh, basically, uh, Chris, what I'm going to do is I'm going to explain uh, what it is that this does. I'm going to show you uh, just a quick uh, animated video that we put together that kind of shows you also how it can help out. Uh, I'm going to just show you a store that we did. I went ahead and uploaded a store uh, for Gibson County Soccer Club and I'm going to kind of show you some of the functions uh, and how to place an order, the administrative features of it that shows you how it is that you can know what it is that you're making, uh, how many sales you had, and what kind of uh, what, what you expect to be sent to you at the end of each month. I'm going to also kind of show you a success story. I was telling you about John Adams and how he used this, and he's been one of the most successful ones we've had. Sell My Tees was basically set up so that people could have a convenient way to distribute their own shirts. What we found out, obviously, is that a lot of people that are like yourself in administrative roles or coaches or whoever, they spend a lot of time doing things other than just coaching and doing what it is that you need to do. Basically, when you use Sell My Tees, what you've done is you've used an online app, but you've also used the service of the whole company. And what we'll do for you is we'll do everything from the order taking to the customer service to the printing and the distribution. We're going to collect the money. We're going to have a record of everybody that has bought a shirt and so we know what sizes they have. And then at the end of each month, we distribute the money back to you. And ideally, we do that either by PayPal, which is the number one way of being able to transfer the money, or if you want to, we can do it by check also. So let's start out by opening up this, this video that we've made. And it's just, like I said, it's just basically a quick intro as to uh, what Sell My Tees is about. Coaches, leagues, school clubs, nonprofit groups, bands. What do they have in common? They all need shirts and a way to raise money, but ordering shirts for a group and fundraising can be time-consuming hassles. You must get individual sizes and quantities, obtain a design and prepay for the order, and someone has to find the time to pick up the order, distribute shirts to the group, and collect payment. And often, you're faced with unpaid orders, wrong sizes, unclaimed shirts, and excess stock. What if your group isn't large enough to meet the minimum order requirement? Lacks the budget to pay in advance? Or can't create a design? SellMyTees.com fixes everything at no cost to you. SellMyTees takes the order, no minimum required, gets individual sizes and collects payments all online. Sell My Tees then prints the shirts and distributes directly to your customers. And here's how it works. Anyone can log on to SellMyTees.com and open an online store for free. Use the designer studio to create amazing tees or upload your own designs. It's simple and easy to use. You decide the markup for each shirt created. This is the amount you earn with every item sold. Your customers or group members can now buy shirts directly from your store at SellMyTees.com. This is how you raise funds without investing any money in little time. SellMyTees.com. Open your store today. Okay, Chris, now that uh, you've kind of got an idea of, of what the benefits of SellMyTees are, let me take you to the real deal. Uh, and what I've done is uh, I went ahead and opened up a store for a Gibson County Soccer Club and I'm going to go to it there's your banner and we uh, have already uploaded some fake shirts and and so this is the look uh, when somebody comes to your store uh, this area here is basically your store you can have multiple pages and you can put up to 15 type shirts on every page so what I assumed we would do is which we did for other leagues and have done for other leagues is is put up the name of every team and then the parents can go in and personalize it. So we're just going to act like these are different teams 
and so obviously there's one team uh, and so on and so forth okay so and obviously you can do this any way you want if you have just a regular team logo or team sponsor name we can put that on there instead of your logo it just seems to me that it makes sense to advertise the Gibson County Soccer Club along with the team and then let somebody put their name and number on the back okay so let's say I'm a parent and I've got a kid on this team what I would do is go in here and just place an order and this is one of the features that you can put in the edit I've made it so that the only color that's available is the color of this team now that can be changed and while I'm on this I'll just show you like this logo right here uh, it's just generic it's just advertised the league and if you wanted to buy it in any color you just click on it it's going to take you to the checkout and you'll see that here I've defaulted it so that you can do it in any color you want so uh, that's an option that you can it's, it's up to you how you want to do it okay let me go back to your store and show you how uh, the main way that your league I think could make some income so the parent wants to go in there, grandparent, uh, brother, sister, and add name and number to the, the, the kid that's playing. So I'm going to go in here, I'm going to say, okay, uh, I want a shirt, my wife wants a shirt. Okay, the thing I do is go and personalize. Okay, once they hit personalize, it's going to take them to our designer studio. And when they go to designer studio, all they have to do is hit this name and number, and I just put in the name. So, go ahead and there's uh, the first one, and then there's the second one. Okay, I'm done. Uh, now let's say we wanted this to be white. All they have to do is click on there, you go to this box, and you select what color you want. And in this case, I said I want it white, so I've changed it to white and that's as simple as it gets and then you just go to save to cart and when they go and purchase they're going to go in here to their cart and you'll see that I've got a medium and I've got a large if I want to show the personalization it shows what I put on that one it shows what I put on that one okay now it's sit check out this is what we do okay obviously you want to add the information of who's purchasing phone number my email address my address I want it shipped to if I want it shipped to city state zip code okay and now that's shipping that's billing and we're gonna say it's the same and I go to finalize okay now payment information People can obviously pay by MasterCard or Visa. It's all credit card. Uh, if you want to pay by PayPal, you can. So those are the three ways that people can pay it. Obviously, that's self-explanatory. Down here, uh, we default it to uh, USPS. So we could, for uh, to buy two shirts at six fifty-five. If somebody buys one shirt, I think it's like four dollars and ten cents, something like that. Uh, but a lot of people in this area will obviously just choose to pick up. In that case, you'll see down here we've got shipping. I'm going to opt just to pick it up. And when I do that, you'll see that shipping has been taken off. Okay, so if we've got a, a code here for a discount, we've got it right here. Um, and that's it. It's as simple as that. Uh, you just hit agree, and then they place their order now I'm going to go back to home and I'm going to show you how you can keep track what we want to do is make sure that you always know how much you can make 
how much you have made, uh, all the sales you made, because obviously, uh, without that, you know, what's used to doing this. So, okay, I have logged in to uh, a different store because they obviously have activity, and I wanted to show you how it, how it works. So once you're logged in, you can tell you're logged in because your banner will take over up here. And then down here, you'll see edit under the, uh, the shirts and things. Let's go into store manager because this is how you see things. You go into store orders and let's just kind of back up and just show you what happens. So this shows you all the orders and then this over here is your markup, I mean your net profit. Here's, here's uh, the uh, total markup of the whole order. And then down, it lists obviously and carries on and tells you how much you've made. Okay, so uh, right here is just the, where we put your banner. Uh, right here is the library of designs that we upload. In this case, it would be all your teams. And then here is where you can edit things. So if you want to uh, add the markup, here's where you put the name of it. Uh, there's your markup, and here's tags this over. Here's tags to put in if you want to put in a quick, quick description. And here's where I was talking about the colors of the shirts that are available. In this case, just this one color is available. Uh, front personalization is if you want somebody to be able to put their name on the front, which sometimes can be a very good thing. Uh, we can, for example, on your design, make it so that uh, where it has the team at the top and maybe the kid's name at the bottom. Uh, it does keep the price down because there's just only one location. Uh, but most people opt off because they don't want you to don't want to mess up with their logo. Go to back. Okay. Uh, if you ever wanted to do a promotion, that's what this is about. And what you're doing is just adding a coupon. So if you want to make it so that people come to it, you can say, okay, for a given amount of time, we're going to do. Uh, coupon and we're going to give you a discount of two dollars and it's going to run from this month to this month you can submit it and then you go back to your list and you can say okay see here's what you here's your coupon okay we want to get rid of that because I don't think Gibson Southern would like to have that okay so that's what the uh, that's that's how you Basically, take care of your designs and decide your markup and things like this. By the way, all this, we can do it for you. I'm just showing you how it works. Okay, so now if you wanted to set up a store, all you really have to do is go to Open My Store. And what we need on this end is that somebody comes in here and just titles the name of the store. In this case, we've already got you set up and we would need to update your email ID which is the person who will get a confirmation every time something is sold and obviously the contact information so if we have communication problems or something that we can take care of it real quickly um, margin of payment this is uh, how we pay you uh, do not do direct bank transfer uh, it just doesn't work well anymore PayPal or by check is the way to do this the login information and I've already got that set up for you and we can change it so that it fits and just only you know it. That's pretty much it. What happens is that uh, uh, with these designs too we can we can print as many colors and there is no extra charge. We can print one at a time and there is no extra charge. Uh, that's how we are set up primarily to do one-offs and take care of one person at a time. Uh, we've done this locally for, you know, I've already shown you John Adams, we've done it for the Owensville Softball Baseball League, we've done it for Fort Branch Baseball League, and these are ones last year. Some people to talk to is uh, Jason Green in Owensville and Warren Fleetwood, uh, he's in Fort Branch. We've done some other stores too, we've, there's some people in at Wood Memorial who uh, worked with the cheerleading that we've done it for that's been successful for them. You will not lose using this. 
Our job is to make your job easy and hopefully to make it so that organizations that do good, which obviously the, something like the soccer league is something that helps the kids out, can raise more income in a niche that you already have but maybe not have utilized as well as you could. Not trying to take your other printer from you? Absolutely not. That's not my intention. My intention is to try to do things where everybody comes out ahead rather than trying to fight one another. And not that other printers fight each other, but there's competition out there and that's not what we're after. Okay, so let's see the uh, video here uh, and then that'll be it. A winning combination. A local high school athletic department scores a win selling t-shirts online. Let's find out more. Sell My Tees, it's a program that Chips Incorporated made. We made it because we found out that people needed more convenience. Basically, it's an online program. You upload your own store. You do that at no charge. We sell your product. And when we sell your product, we take care of the order. We take care of the production. We take care of the shipping. We do the customer service. We collect the money, and then we give you the money back. Basically, the way you earn your money is there's a wholesale cost. And with the wholesale cost, we charge your client. You never pay me a dime. And then the client comes in, and you add a markup to your shirt. You collect the markup. So after that's all said and done, at the end of the month, we send that to you. It's been very successful. There's a local store. It's called South Gibson Athletics. They did a bulk order. What that means is we took all of their orders at one time and printed it at one time, and then we delivered it at one time. We sent them the shirts. They were given an Excel file with the sizes each person bought, and each person already bought it. They didn't have to worry about if anybody was going to pay for their shirt, and they knew all the sizes were correct. They were all handed out, already paid for. We delivered the shirts to them, and we gave them cash. And in their case, they, we gave them almost $3,500 for just two weeks of work. Here's a few things Athletic Director John Adams had to say about the SellMyTees.com fundraising program. I don't blow smoke. SellMyTees.com is legit. I just received a check for $3,482.79. This was with only three weeks of sales. SellMyTees.com is the best thing we have ever done with t-shirts. For more information, please visit SellMyTees.com.